Hey, I got pickaxe proficiency. Nice. I can now craft a cherry bomb. Nice. I don't know what in the hell I would use that for. Uh, in the mines. Because there's shit oh, there's... that wants to eat us down there. <laughs> for a thousand gold. Yeah, okay. Oops. So what's with the petals falling everywhere? That's the pollen. Hmm. Okay. I don't really know what it does for us or against us, but it's pollen. <laughs> Okay, so I did just grow some parsnips. I'm gonna keep them in one of my chests. Um, I'm going to sell two of them, because I did grow 14. I think they're only worth like 15 gold a piece or something, but they are also consumables that will replenish our energy, so I don't want to sell all of them. That is fair. I do have some wood in one of my chests, so if you want to build the fence or whatever, then feel free to use whatever mine that you need. What's mine Fair. is yours. I have hundreds of wood. Well, so. that's you've been chopping down those trees, so I assumed, but like, I also don't want you to worry about like if I have plans for it because I totes do not. We unlocked the community center. Yeah, I'm, I'm in that cutscene right now. The same. It dragged me in. So this would probably oh. be like what happens when it does it for us both. Yeah. Sorry. No, you're good. To be fair, if it dragged I us both... Just the fence. If it dragged us both into this, then it probably isn't going to dock us any time. Because, like, if I'm in a cutscene but you're not, like, time still passes. Anything. Oh my god, this one's long. Can I- Oh, I can skip it. Skip! Yeah, I was gonna say, I already did. Okay, so there is going to be a fence near your house. Okay. I don't know if you're gonna like it aesthetic. <laughs> it's not great to build diagonally in this. house just happens to be there and I am big on stray lines. That aesthetic. Seriously? Yeah, it, it looks fine.
Yeah, the little post thing is a gate. Okay. Yeah, you right click on it, it'll open. Because <coughs> I figured you'd want to be able to get through the fence that I just attached to your house, so. There, and now we have a clear line from my house to yours, and zero chance of getting lost. Yay! Thank you. No problem. It will honestly help me a ton. spend the rest of the day fishing and basically sell whatever fish I'm able to catch because I bought a lot of seeds and now we have no money. Uh, there is a bridge on the beach that we can build and expand to the second part of the beach. It does cost 300 wood, but you did say you had a bunch of wood, so you may do it that way you will. Uh, I'll do that in a minute. I'm building a cobblestone path right now. Oh, check you out. I didn't want to get too close to your gardens, but there's a cobblestone path leading up to those blue seed looking things. Hey, thank you. And all the way back to my house. <clears throat>
So I just took on a delivery thing, got us 135 monies. Because nice. Linus wanted a bream, and I didn't accept it because I couldn't remember specifically where or when or how to get bream. But then I caught one, and I'm like, excellent, I'm going to take on this quest or this delivery, and I'm just going to bring it straight to him, and bang, bang, boom, got us $135. <laughs> nice. Which seems weird to me. Like, I don't know how much the conversion rate to a gold to a dollar or whatever it is. Um, but Linus is homeless. So that just seems like a lot of money to drop for a fish. Yeah, that's pretty fair. See the path? I do see the path. I am having a hard time closing... There we go. I was having a hard time closing the gate. Yeah, you have to like walk right into the thing. It's weird. I had a problem time trying to open it the first time. You're starting to feel exhausted, okay. I mean, it is getting late. It's 10 o'clock. Toss those in there. I'll go to bed. I love it up in farming. I can craft a scarecrow now. Yes. Oh my god, no more crows. Okay. That is a hundred and ninety dollars. That's not great, but money, yay. <laughs> I should have something. Hey, I got Parsnips. Oh! Crow took my thing again! I am figuring out what I need to craft that scarecrow right fucking now! Can you craft one over here too? I don't know if I have enough. Well, oh, I got plenty of wood. Never mind. <laughs> I mean, I haven't played a ton of this game, <clears throat> but in the bit of this game that I have played, I've never had a problem with scarecrows. Right? What? I can move the thing around, right? I don't know. Can I just give it to you? Yeah, yeah. How do I do that? <laughs> just place it where I'm standing. You see where I'm standing? Yep. In between your plants there? Yeah, just like... Like, literally right where I'm at, like, on the untilled soil. Perfect. <clears throat> yeah, and I can totally just hit it with an axe and it becomes, like, a... Oh, okay. Like a thing. Perfect. So, yeah, we can totally move them around. I mean, it, w it would make more sense to be able to move it around, but I also didn't want to, like... Oh, you can absolutely move it around, and then you go to, like, axe it, and it breaks, and then I just wasted all of that material. That's fair. I was willing to risk it for the biscuit. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I got a gold-quality parsnip. I'm gonna hold on to that one. I have a silver one in my crate. Like, feel free to rob those whenever you see fit. I mean, I got quite a bit of stuff over here, so I should be good, but I, I do appreciate it's just that. Some of the stuff in there is like geodes and stuff that you can sell that I have no intention of bringing to town. I mean, I am probably going to come take your geodes. <laughs> There's parsnips in there, too. Some 
more time I have to mine, the more time I have to find geodes. I really need to get a better axe and a better... What's it called? Well, it's, we can head... We can head into the mine, and when we get um, copper, we can forge that into ore, and then we can get you a better axe. That would be ideal. I feel like today is a little bit too far along, considering it's almost noon, so maybe on the next rainy day we can just head out right away. Sure. When I went fishing before, the mine wasn't open. I don't know what opens it. Yeah, we're, um, we're gonna need that to happen first, too. So, I crafted some field snacks for you. They offer health and energy, but because you're going through your energy more, I just put it in your chest, and I'm fine eating wild horseradish or parsnips or whatever. I mean, honestly, what I've been doing is going out mining the hell out of my area. Like, if you go, like, southwest from my house, it's like a fucking field. The only thing that's left are the big stumps and rocks that I can't do anything to. Yeah. So it does take one or two in-game days for Clint to make the axe for you. And we can only do one at a time, so you can pick the axe or the pickaxe when we get there. Probably. But... Depending on how the mine goes, it would probably be the pickaxe. <laughs> But the axe, like, being able to just melt through trees at the handy and, like, you know, stuff. But whichever one I go with, the other one's next. What was that? What was what? Philistine? Okay. I've got you up on my other monitor. Oh, well that's, I don't know what that is either, but we're going to donate it to the museum. Oh, yeah, new yeah, reward. Earth crystal. Nice. Rewards. Oh, cauliflower seeds. Oh, do I have enough time to plant those? I might. It's only 2 p.m. I don't see why you would have. Well, no, no, no. I mean, because they take 12 days, and if they aren't grown by the time the season ends, we just lose them. But it, uh -huh. we're, we're only on the 6th of the month, so we, I should still have plenty of time. Yeah. Because the days are 20, or the months are 22 days long? I don't remember. Only eight days long, maybe? I really don't remember. <laughs> Elliot! Elliot, come here! You found a lost book? Yeah. Um, if you ever see worms wiggling out of the ground, if you hoe yeah, them, I they're just hiding. Did it. Yeah. Yeah, I got two things of mixed seeds and we're about to plant them. Oh, nice. That's what I've been doing, is just like getting random. I've got four things growing right now. I have no idea what it is. But... Just gonna fill my water up again. Back to being a lumberjack. I feel like you'd make a good lumberjack. What makes you say that? I don't know. You're tall. You've got some broad shoulders. Spare. Put you in a nice little plaid <laughs> button-up shirt. Where your head was at. I knew it. Like the brawny I'll paper towel man. <laughs> don't judge me. <laughs> I'm not judging you. I feel like there's a little bit of judgment. Not even a little bit. <laughs> yep, I'm exhausted. 
across it again. Let's walk my tired ass back home. But it's cutting down trees and mining and stuff does take a ton out of you. And we're regenning. Look at your garden. <laughs> nice. I mean, this entire patch that I'm working on is just uh, cauliflower, so. I ended up getting eight, or sorry, nine seeds from that thing that I donated, or the rewards for donating, so. Nice. And I feel like cauliflower are worth a decent chunk. We do, we can donate some to the community center, so I don't want to sell all of them, but I mean, we don't need 11 cauliflower, so I'll probably sell two or three of them. That's and, fair. And then we should get some decent money for that. Hopefully. Right to the water hole. Well, I still got a ton of energy, but it's getting late, so I don't want to. That's fine. Have I have to... about the same amount of energy, so I'm going to go chop more wood. What I like about rainy days is that I go fishing. I haven't fished in a while because we've just been dealing with sunny bullshit. I don't like the sun. Exhausted again, going to the bed. I have 423 wood in my fucking crate. If you you can probably go fix that bridge, bridge then. I could, or I could stay in here and continue organizing this mess of a place we've got. Oh, hey, my mining went up. I can craft a cherry bomb now. Nice. Okay, we got one more axe proficiency. I can craft a survival burger. Oh, nice. Oh, it's gonna rain tomorrow. You know what that means. Mining? Or, like, mm. mine traveling. Not just mining, not just simple mining. We're actually gonna go on an adventure. Yes.
Okay, so I found another house. Oh, great. <laughs> but it's like ruins. Oh, yes, that will become a greenhouse eventually. I don't even know if I got far enough in the game to get that greenhouse. So then, regardless of the season, we can grow whatever we want. Okay. It's like just north of my house. Okay, so we can definitely access the mines. I decided to come up to this river to go fishing just to make sure that we could get there, and we can. So, tomorrow we That's can just good. head straight to the mine. Sounds good to me. Well, I still have three people left to greet, and I was trying to rack my brain to figure out who that still was. It's Demetrius Sebastian. And I cannot for the life of me figure out the third. Unless the third was Elliot. Hold on, maybe I haven't checked the list since I actually spoke to Elliot. Ah, so yes, I'm just missing Demetrius and Sebastian. I have no idea where they are. <laughs> That's the thing that I don't like about that introduction thing, is that it wants you to go talk to all of the townsfolk, but, you, like, they're in different places at different times on different days, and, like, I just- I don't have time for that. Maybe it'll happen when it happens. the cobblestone path from my gate to the greenhouse. Okay. I figured like it was already kind of in line. It sort of made sense. Come back, follow the house, like the cobblestone path to the lighthouse north of my house, and then just go up behind the house. You'll see a cave. Oh, sorry, the cave? Yeah. Uh, eventually, we can have fruit bats in there. Or there's something else. There's another option. Demetrius is like, hey, that's unused potential. 
let me do something with that cave. <coughs> I have nearly chopped like probably half of this place down. I've stayed away from like your house. I mean, just don't hurt my crops. <laughs> I won't. Put a parsnip in the box. Okay, thank you. I'm gonna come back and put- I presume you mean the selling box? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna put pretty much every single fish that I've caught, because I've caught quite a bit, and they're in a range of qualities, so we should be getting some pretty good money. About the biggest reason that I want more inventory space because I can't catch another fish right now. Like, I can continue to catch more fish of the same type I've been and quality that I. Clearing the area that I'm at. Because, like, I'm chopping down and getting three different types of tree seeds. Yeah. And I'll see. break a stone so I can get some fiber. Or Occasionally get like mixed seeds will drop or I'll get a geode and it'll just sit there on the ground until I drop stuff. Excellent timing, Sebastian. I met everyone. <laughs> Is I was checking to see if Sebastian was in his room, and until you're friends, you can't go into their individual bed spaces. Um, but he was just coming out of his room. I'm like, ah, oh, sweet. So that'll do that, and I don't know if I can get money for that. Oh, he wants Here's me to get check the journals. Oh yeah, it's trying to make you like build a relationship with someone. I mean, I, I kind of figured that quest line was going to lead to that. I do have a Joja Cola, which I know Sam likes because I usually opt for romancing Sam. So I'll just give him a Joja Cola and then everything will be good. <laughs> Fair. Okay. One of that. I see you, big ol' owl.
Oh shit, it's getting late. Mm -hmm. Um, I think you start getting a warning at midnight that it's getting late and you will pass out at 2 a.m. I level up in fishing. Nice. 702 gold. Oh shit. Yeah, some of those fish. Oh, the largemouth bass was worth 125. Nice. Yeah. I'm the gold level carp was only worth 45. That's so unfortunate. But hey, 700 on top of the 490 or whatever that we already had, so we're getting closer to one of us getting a backpack upgrade. Yeah. On my way to the mine. Actually, tomorrow's going to be a sunny day. Everything but my. <coughs> Should have thought about this before. Uh, bring food, also. Uh. Bring food? Yeah. We're gonna need it. I'm quickly gonna go find Sam, give him this Joja Cola, and then I'll meet you at the mine. As I see you running up behind me. I have detoured slightly because I've seen a dandelion. <laughs> a dandelion. Let me in your house. Damn. Let me give you this I'm Joja Cola. Jo jo where? I don't know where the fuck I'm going. Uh, up. Like from the Joja Mart, go a little bit to the left until you find a path and then go up. You might have to cross to the other side of the river and then go up. I don't remember. with the telescope out front. Okay, so go to the right of that and then continue following the path right and up. There you go. Oh my god, I'm about to give this Joja Cola to literally anyone else because Sam is still in bed. <sighs> Get it is after 10 o'clock in the morning and I need you to come take this damn cola out of my hands. He's been standing in front of his dresser for 30 minutes. Doesn't know what to wear. I mean, he's gonna wear exactly what he's already wearing. Dude, come get the damn cola. And now he's practicing his guitar. Your kid gets the cola. Your kid? Sorry, your brother gets the cola. That was worth 100 gold, even though Vincent didn't like the cola. <laughs> That's not what I wanted at all. 
I notice I have a health bar now. Do I? The eventually you'll come up to bugs that will try to eat you. Can I just use my axe? Um, you should have been given a sword. I was. Yeah, use the sword. And if there's any boxes or crates down there, break those open, because sometimes there will be a club or a better sword that does more damage. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I don't know why. Oh. I mean, usually I'm that's... just sitting here. That, that's usually my issue, and I'm apologizing about the disturbance I'm making, so tag, you're it. <laughs> Turn around to see if the dog is still with me, and he is completely upside down sleeping. So I need you. I'm I'm coming. I'm in the cutscene to get the sword, so I'll be right there. I already cleared the first floor. Okay. I can't pick up some of the stuff that's on the ground. And one's one of those earth stones. So Sorry about that. About what? My headphones fell off. Didn't hear anything. Okay, I figured there might have been a crash and then so I just kind of shouted, Headphones down! Didn't hear the headphones down. Okay, good, great. <laughs> Okay, stop, stop talking. Yes, Marlin, you're a delightful human being, let me go. Okay. You're gonna have a bunch of stuff to pick up, for sure. Oh, is that why you needed me to just pick up all this stuff? Yeah. Oh, look. And that open. So there's two ways down. There's one back there, but I've been trying to make sure I get all of these stones. I mean, it's mostly these ones. We want the copper ore. I've got five pieces of copper ore. I just picked up two. Nice. go back to the other ladder and go down that one instead. I feel like it's still gonna bring you down here, but we'll see. No time like the present to find out. Uh, Hi. I, see you. I I see you. <laughs> oh well, I, I found the next ladder or a next ladder. I'm starting to feel exhausted. Okay. Score five and we'll eat it. Yes. I'm just gonna eat all of these. No, I'll, <laughs> I'll probably need them. I have no more inventory s- oh, I was supposed to say I have no more inventory space, I can't pick up stone, but apparently I do have stone, so I guess I can help you. It's just like I'm gonna want to make something with it at some point, so like I might as well. Here, and I just got another piece of copper ore. Nice. And we can- use the mine shaft every five floors, but we have to discover those floors before we can go back to them. Alright, well, we've got a- like, I've got nine pieces of copper ore. I'm going down. What is that? It's a bug. It's a dead bug. Okay. <laughs> Got 
15 copper ore now. Nice. Oh, there's more copper ore over there. seeds can you pick that up i cannot but i do just have a couple pieces of wood that i can drop and pick up the seeds in this place it's not like we're hurting on wood here, so. here, 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 here. hold on i'm just gonna eat all of these don't do that i mean those well, things aren't anyway. pardon i'm out of energy anyway and i can make the survival hamburgers now i can mine them. looking for the eggs now, yeah? Uh, I think so. Oh, there is a ladder up here. Oh, let's take it. There yeah, we have the elevator. Ow. Ow. Wish. Uh, can you pick that up? Nope. That's just green algae. Alright, I picked up the algae. I also put a torch in the ground. I don't know how I had a torch. <laughs> okay, it's getting very late. It's already 9.30pm. So let's take the elevator. We can come back to this. Well, that's... Because I already have stone in my inventory, I'm gonna harvest a little bit more stone and then, then I'll piece out. Yeah, so forever we can now use that elevator to come back to floor 5. Or we can continue to just go down the ladders and then re-farm everything that we just did. I mean, if stuff respawns, I might, but I'll probably just jump forward when I can. I don't know if I needed to or wanted to accept that, but we need to find three anchovies now. Oh! Uh, so, I mean, you need to find three anchovies. I don't have that delivery. Uh, okay. So that's just not gonna happen. <laughs> So I didn't need anything but the axe and the mining pick in there. I mean, I always keep the hoe on me just in case I go buy worms. And then the Oh, they sword. can be in there too? No, just on the way. Okay. To that mine. Because I've had that before that on my way I've missed like three of them and then I have to come back for the hoe to pick up all three and it's just... It does take up a, an inventory slot, but I find that it's kind of useful to keep the hoe on you just in case. <laughs> 